As you know, rendering 3D models requires a powerful and expensive system. But did you know that with AI you can get the same high quality render for free without needing expensive hardware? In this video, I will show you how to model this exhibition stand and also teach you how to render with AI for free. So let's jump in. At first, let me draw a rectangle by 40 centimeter comma 150 enter like this then by using offset tool take an offset by 10 centimeter like this select this face and scale it up to here and here too like this now let me raise this line then by using line tools let me draw a line here by 400 centimeter and another line and line this axis let me lock the axis by browse key and type for example 900 centimeter like this and another line here let me lock the axis by say 100 centimeter and another one lock the axis move it up to here like this now let me draw guidelines here by 100 centimeter and here too and here too because I want to fill it the corner at the same angle like this and this one too like this and now let me delete the guides then select the lines we should deselect this face you can hold the shift key and double click on it like this then by using follow me tools click on this face select all and make it group draw rectangle 150 comma so 150 like this now let me fillet this corner by using our tools let me extrude it by 20 centimeter like this and select all and make it group then draw a rectangle here I want to use this one as a wall list let me make it in group now let me create a disk here So guys, as you can see, our work is ready to take a render with Prume AI. So let's do it. First, we need to export an image from our project. Go to 
File, Export, and click on 2D Graphic. And in here, you can choose a name for that and click on Export. Then go to Nystar's website. I've shared its link in description. Come down and find Prima AI and click on it. If you're visiting Prumi AI for the first time, you're in for a treat. You will receive 10 free coins as a welcome gift. So, at first you should log in with your Gmail. I don't want to do it because I did it before. So now let me tell you how we can take a render with Prumi AI. At first you will see this face go to AI tools and in here first option is sketch rendering click on it and in here you can add that image you want to take a render for click on add in here upload let me find our project select and click on open. As you can see in here, our image is imported. And in here, you should write a good prompt for your project. Describe about that thing you want to have in your project. It's so important, you should do it. And the next option is reference image. You can upload a reference image and in here you can and choose a style for your model. As you can see, there is a different style. You can choose one of them. For example, I choose this one. And also in here you can choose a scene for your model. For example, I choose this one and this one, for example. And also mode, you can choose one of them. For example, I choose this one. And in here, negative prompt, you can write something that you don't want to see in your project. I don't want to type anything in here. It's better to type something here. So, and also perspective in here you can choose a perspective view for your model for example I choose this one and lighting type there is different type of lighting for example I choose this one I think just we can Choose one of them. And also in here you can determine how many image you want to take render from your model. For example, one, two, and three. And at the end, click on generate. Maybe it takes a few moments. So guys, as you can see, Prumi AI has generated three renders for us. So let's take a look. Wow, as you can see, this is amazing. Look at the reflection on the floor. And what about lighting? I think it's so beautiful. At all, it's really great. I love it. You should try it too. It's awesome. I hope this tutorial was useful and helpful for you. For more tutorial, please subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't already. And don't forget to like, comment and share the video with your friends.